Hey guys, welcome to Inspire to Cook. Today I'm gonna show you a very, very smart tip. I did this when I was dating my wife and I was short in cash and I couldn't afford the flowers. I'm gonna show you how to make onion flowers and they're gonna be so beautiful. Your girl's gonna be so amazed and the best part about it, you get to eat it. All you need for this recipe is three onions. I'm using purple onions, but you can use any onions. And we need balsamic vinegar and olive oil, one tablespoon of each per onion. So we need three tablespoons of each. And of course, salt and pepper. We're gonna preheat our oven at 425 degrees Fahrenheit before we do anything else. So I peeled my onion and I cut off the bottom so it actually sits flat when you sit it. It doesn't fall down. And I'm gonna cut it in the middle, not all the way down, leaving about, about half inch to quarter inch. I'm gonna turn it and cut it in half again so we get quarters and in half again so we get eighths. This is how it's gonna look and I'm gonna sit it aside and I'm gonna do the same with the rest of the onions. And we're gonna transfer the onions into a bowl. Add three tablespoons of olive oil, one tablespoon per onion, and three tablespoons of balsamic vinegar. Followed by some salt and pepper of course and it's about to get greasy we're gonna mix it up and make sure the onions actually soak through it very well the way i like to do it is just steal it to one side and uh, baste each onion in there just like that and make sure it's greased up really nice and we're gonna lay them out in the pan and we're gonna get the rest of the balsamic vinegar and oil sauce and put them right, right on top of the onion, just like that. So it marinates right inside of it. And we're gonna cover it up with the foil and it's ready to go into the oven. After 25 minutes in the oven, we uncovered it and let it bake for another 10 minutes. And look at that. Look how beautiful these onion flowers look. And it's final time to try it. Well, we're just gonna cut one of those petals out and we're gonna give it a taste. The balsamic vinegar with oil makes a really perfect combination. This is the best kind of flower she can get. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to try this. Let me know in the comments below what you think. And I'll see you next time. I did it. <laughs> I'm about to say it. I did this when I was dating my wife and was short on cash. And instead of getting... I, was, I wasn't dating a cheap guy. No, no, don't, don't bring me today. <laughs> so you never uh, brought me flowers. <laughs>